What's up, everybody? Welcome to the weekly appearance of Sam and Liam. I'm Sam. I'm Liam, and we're interviewing big names throughout the school, so tune in for the ride. What's up, everybody? I'm Sam Fisher. I'm Liam Thompson, and this week we're interviewing Miss Overbeck. So, Miss Overbeck, um, how would you describe a day in the life as a nurse here in North Central? Um, well, I would say that the interesting, the thing I like the most about it is that you never know who's going to come in the door. So you have to be ready to be flexible. You have to be ready to deal with whatever situation comes up. You never know what's going to happen. Um, what is the most frequent injury or illness that you see throughout the year? Uh, probably the most frequent illness is like sore throats, headaches, nausea, vomiting, those kinds of things. Illnesses, hopefully, I mean, as far as accidents, hopefully we don't have a lot of accidents. We haven't had, we don't have too many accidents. So that's just a good thing. Um, what would you say your busiest part of the year is? is because everybody comes and we have um, things that we have to be responsible for getting information from parents from kids in order for them to be successful in North Central so we have to make sure that we have all the uh, pieces in place to make it work there are state laws that govern the way we treat kids at school and so we have to make those make sure that we have the information from the parents the information about the kids and that we get that information to the teachers so that they can be teacher to have somebody have a seizure in the classroom and the teacher have no idea that that might happen or how to respond to that. So those are, the, I think, the beginning of the school year is the hardest time of the year. So that's even busier than now, like the flu season? Right. Flu season is just, we deal with kids as they come in, they're sick, we take care of them, they come home, but there's so many things we have to be responsible for in order for this, for this the state requirements. So it's a busy thing. Um, Going along with that question, like, what would you say your busiest time in the day is in the school day? Um, lunch periods. Lunch periods are busy. Kids, a lot of times parents will tell kids to come and give it a try, and so they do give it a try. And then by the time lunchtime rolls around here, they feel that they can't make it. And also the lunch periods are, are uh, busy times when the kids come in here that they feel like they, they're not feeling well all day. It's a time in the middle of the day that they decide they can't. Kids don't eat either. That's the other thing. We're so if they don't eat, if you don't eat, you're gonna have a headache, and you're likely to not you're not gonna be able to do your best. Um, what do you feel your effect has been on the school overall throughout here? Well, let's see. What do I feel? I feel like um, there are a lot of kids that don't um, have anybody to relate to at home, maybe, or in their lives. And I do think that kids come in here kids come in here and we have new nurses I tell them that they come in here for like nothing things but I think that what they do is they're just checking me out to see how I relate to them or how I relate to the other kids that are in here at the same time and sometimes they share things with me they've never shared with anyone else and I can help them get resources I can help them through their day I can refer them to their counselor or whomever can help them you know you guys are so lucky to have what you have and a lot of kids don't have kids I think will find us and we'll be able to help them get through their day and get through their life. Mm -hmm, yeah. Be happy and healthy. Well, thank you for your and time. That's it. Okay. Yeah. Great. Thank you guys. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you guys for watching Weekly Appearance. We'll catch you next week.